Hello friends, Techman Pat here. I hope you are well. Welcome to a Dirt Report. This one is going to be quick. We've got an update on the NTDs for your NBN connections. The ones that are going to get you multi-gigabit speeds at home. Now we've seen some renderings of what these NTDs are going to look like, but LeapTels has uh, shared some images that has led to a website that NBCO had to make live. So make sure to like and subscribe. Welcome to The Dirt Report and let's get started by rolling the intro. Now, big thanks to Ahmed for letting me know about this so I could share it with everyone here. So let me take you through what has happened over the weekend, apart from the obvious one, the elections. I hope everybody enjoyed their freedom sausage. In any case, on the forum, Willpool, we had some people share some content. A ISP representative from LeapTel shared some images of the new NTDs in real life. So here we have it. They look well, they look really nice, actually. They look really nice and small, especially the single port one. And this is the four port one. You can see here, it's a little bit larger. On and off switch, light, looks a little bit more sleeker. It is uh, a lot smaller, and it also takes up a lot less space if it is actually mounted in the uh, mounting equipment that comes with these new NTDs. And look, I'm really happy with this. It means that it's gonna take up less space and the power requirements are also, I think a little bit smaller. So the brick that's gonna power this is going to be smaller, which means there's a lot less power draw on your home. And I think a lot of people, you know, nowadays when power is so expensive might be quite happy. So I'll put the links below to the photos, but what's more important is this QR code that leads to a, an NBN page. And these are the official NBN pages that are now have, well, they're gone live. So they're fully live, you can access this on the links that I'll provide below. And they give you a bit of a background about the NTDs. You've got two versions. You have both the single port and the four port. What's really interesting is that if you do click into one of these, let's say the one port, you'll see a little note here that says available from September. Now I assume that's 2025 because that's the month that's sort of coming up this year. So if it was next year, that's say 2026, but this is really exciting. You will be getting the new NTDs to get multi gigabit speeds from September. Now, if I just go back to the photos here, I just want to share something. Uh, even the four port here, there is no SFP plus, which is unfortunate because the latest routers from some of the biggest brands out there have SFP P plus ports, which means they can have a lot more throughput through the one cable. And now with multi gigabit speeds, potentially with these NTDs, it's a missed opportunity, I think. So uh, look, that's, uh, that's a shame. Now, the new NTDs will actually fit the old mounts, which I'm really, uh, I mean, I was expecting this, but I'm really happy to hear. It does mean that it's still taking up a lot of space and then just sort of slip it in, but uh, you know, don't worry, they won't have to redo everything. It's more like a plug and play. You can unplug the optical cable, plug the new one in, uh, put your own plugs in and, and off you go. And I think there's a little gap fill for the single entity. This is a photo of a, a four port one. Now, what kind of speeds can you expect? Well, LeapTel also shared a, a speed test, one MS ping, and 2,106 megabits per second, that's two gigabits. That is amazing uh, speeds. This is obviously the fastest you can go. We have been limited by the modem. So this entity, the new one will provide higher speeds. I'm still questioning why the uploads are so low, but I'm sure there'll be a plan that makes them available to have higher speeds. Obviously you'll pay more, but thousand or one gigabit symmetrical, that's the dream. <laughs> so there you have it folks, a quick update on the latest NTDs. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching The Dirt Report. I'll catch you all in the next one. I hope to be making a lot more videos soon. So stay tuned and I'll see you there. Bye.